Uh, hi. Uh, so, uh, God has really given me an opportunity to practice redemptive suffering. What I mean is, uh, suffering in my life never ends, you know, with respect to physical pain. For some who know, I had this back problem before the conference, after the conference, and it, it's not over. But what I really learned or took back after the conference is that I had this grace not to be bitter about my pain, not to look down at myself and to really offer this pain up. And it didn't end there. Uh, I've got married now, I've been married for two months. And before my wedding, I was sick again. When I was hospitalized, all thanks to Erilson, who did that. Uh, yeah, I was sick, he had no choice but to hospitalize me. And this is, was like one week before my wedding. And, no, and I didn't know what to do. My family didn't know what to do. We were all over the place. But what I really did is on that hospital bed is I could really, you know, offer that sick feeling, the sickness of the ward, everything for various things. Uh, my relationship with my to-be husband, who's now my husband. My relationship with my in-laws. My, my wedding that God may truly be glo glorified. And I believe that he was. And it doesn't end there, you know. Right now, recently in the past three months, I've been having this terrible pain in my right knee. I don't know where it's come from. I only know that it's, it's been three months now and it's, it's disturbing my daily life. Like, I, can, I cannot do so many things. And what I'm doing and I'm really feeling, you know, I'm experiencing grace is to really offer this pain because there's a lot of things happening uh, in my new extended family. There's a lot of pain. There's a lot of emotional pain that I am going through these days. And, uh, and I know that this pain in my knee is not here by chance. I know God is really using this pain in my life. And recently, uh, I mean, Abe, I have been asking many people if they need prayers. There are many who have told me that they need prayers and I have been praying for them. And you know, many look at me like, you know, one baggage of suffering, like everything hurts. Every month something or the other hurts. And I, it doesn't put me down anymore because I know that God is using this for His kingdom. God is using this for different people and for sanctification of our soul. Uh, so yeah, so pray for me. Pray for my healing. I'm, I'm also praying, but pray for me.